plan A was if everything went off without a hitch. From the station, it would have been a straight shot to the reactor. Didn't work out, but we knew going in we had to have alternatives. Backup plans, in case we had to get off early. From closer in to further out, B, C, D, and so on. Up to what? To E. Lucky us. Yeah! <laughs> You're damn right. Anyway, we were riding the train between Sector 4 and the main pillar when we had to bail out. And we ended up on the adjacent line, which should take us to Reactor 5. That's right. So for now, we follow the tracks. Not too far, though. Need to switch to a different route before we hit the station. Because you can bet your ass it's going to be crawling with security. All on high alert. Let's move. Operators in Sector 5 mark the route, so don't worry about getting lost. It's a straight shot to victory, people. All we gotta do is take it. You have nothing to worry about, sir. Preparations for the grand finale are proceeding without incident. I have the utmost confidence that everything will play out as you intended. Yes, of course. I will not fail you, sir. <sighs> sir, analytics reports that the results fall within the admissible range. However, the casualty rate significantly exceeds previous projections. Ah. Remind me what your job is. Is it to question the wisdom of your superiors and bemoan your personal hardships? Sir? Huh. Casualty rate. You think I care about the casualty rate? They're pawns in a greater game. If your stock runs low, then go round up more for Sector 3 or wherever else. Use your head and bring me solutions instead of problems for a change, yes? Sir. <clears throat> it is so hard to find good help these days. Which is why the President ought to count his blessing. What would he do without me? 